welcome back to another episode of Divinity Original Sin. Why am you up? I? Why am I you? You aren't. I am you. Hey, what the? Why am I you? Clicking on my character didn't work. Okay, I'm me again. The first thing I noticed was that I had like quadruple my normal health. All of a sudden, I went from 237 to 780 health. And I'm like, wait, wait, wait. That was weird. Are you recording again? Uh, obviously. Okay. That was weird, though. I don't know why that happened. No, I log in, I'm on your guy, and I'm like, wait a minute. This, this, something's not right. What's going on? We meet again. I was hoping we might. Didn't I already tell you? I like to uh, keep things in check, make sure everything's in its place. A more interesting question is what you are doing here, my strange friend. Did you find what you were seeking since last we met? The mysterious stranger seems to smile. Or is it a grimace? You can't quite tell. He gazes at you without blinking for several long moments. Somebody hand him a fucking quill. Inkwell and okay. piece of paper. Uh, okay. Did he not uh, talk? Well, he did. There was a whole dialogue. But then I told him that, you know, my journey is far from over and everything, and he... Uh, the narrator takes over, saying he stares at you for several long yeah, moments, heard, and then I just heard says, the narrator, and I was like, wait, is he like Wolgriff and just doesn't talk? And then he just says, K, and then teleports away. K. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember anything else up there. I haven't heard my mouth. Ah, dogs. Oh, I should probably let them in before they get muddier. You might want to spread the sheet on the bed. Yeah. And, you know, on top of your uniform. That too. Like having to wash that before going into work and then ending up being super fucking late. Which is fun. Rhymes in our procedures, this immaculate village has increased its production of bloodstone more than fivefold. Remember, time is of the absolute essence, but the goddess hour is nigh. Okay. Oh, Trespasser! The hallowed village of Sacred Stone is hardly open to lost ones of every make and kind. What proof have you of your devotion to the cause to present your immaculate amulet if you are a friend to our cause? God, it's hilarious to see Kiara try to run, your especially your to your eyes from our village. She like waddles. And never return so if you make any of so bad. I'm sure that we could, but we piss all of them off. I'm okay with pissing people off. Yeah, well, this is the, um, side note that there was an NPC that was walking over here who's one of the Immaculates. He walks up to, uh, the gate that's right here, and, uh, is basically talking about bloodstones and how they're producing them. Interesting. Yeah. Oh! Trespasser, present your immaculate amulet. 
turned your impure eyes from our village, lost one, and never return if you... You know what? Let's see how serious they are about that. Apparently they get pretty mad pretty fast. Oh, these guys are... Well, the one guy has a golden border around his name. Yeah, the dude with the golden border around his name has 500 health. That's it? Yeah. What the hell? bunch of them up here. That chest is locked, by the way. At time, the sit will see that the sacrifices to be demands are on the bed. Maybe a bomb. Okay. I'm not entirely sure if I'm in the best spot to teleport it, but I'll try. Teleport it into the doorway that's uh, far, far enough away from you that it won't really cause problems. At least I don't think it'll cause problems. Oh, these guys have high energy. <coughs> Owie. Bad news travels fast! That didn't buff you. Yet yeah, it says I have a 120% chance for it to work. Oh, no, no, my chance to hit just got reduced by 30%. I'm a mage. Come on, dude. Somebody's giving physical immunity. Something. Just how they all ran out like that. Now I can't really teleport the bomb. I mean, technically you can, but you're gonna have to like aim it 
far away. Like, in, like if you can get it inside the doorway two spaces, that would be perfect. Alternately, you see where that, um... See? Oh, killed one of them. I'm still able to put the bombs in somewhat use. <laughs> it just didn't get all of them. Just, you know, the vast majority. This guy kind of stood behind. But he's got fire he has to walk through if he wants to actually get out of here. Jahan thinks you're a rat. <laughs> he wants you to scurry. Went to hell in a handbasket. My God. Okay, so you, no turn. Thank you. Uh, Can you kill the other one? Low health one. You know, I might actually be able to just kill them, all, like kill both of these right here. Maybe. Oh, I don't have enough uh, action points to do that. Kill this one, probably. Nah, I feel like there's no point in wasting that. No. Oh, Your grave opens to welcome you! Beautiful.
one that I just see seeing. Well, here's the thing. You see seeing it just saved either my life or Jahan's. True. Because she would have cut in. Yeah, but it was CC for two turns. Totally could have killed uh, something that would have gotten a turn. Might be able to stun something, though. No, I can't really do anything now with Jahan, except drink the potion. Yeah, I'd recommend doing that. Just waste all your action points to do nothing. No, 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 no. Stop it, you dick. Now I have a friggin' Earth Elemental in my friggin' pants. And I got one shot. Wait. Whoa. That, what? That didn't hit me for 100% of my health, but I died. My life is ebbing away. I had a, I had full health. It hit me for one HP lower than my maximum and it killed me. We may have to restart this encounter. Because like those douchebags that got lured from the back were kind of a problem. you didn't. Invisible breaks if you do anything except remove. AKA, if you did plan on moving, you probably should have cancelled out your uh, precision stance before activating it. Because if you cancel it out, it's most likely going to break invisibility. Because why would it shock the blood? What? Apparently he can see if you're a bit of a score. I think we're gonna have to reload. Oh wait, you revived it. Yes I did. So either revive me, revive uh, Wolgriff, or shoot something. Though, I mean, everything has so much health right now, I don't think we're really going to be able to kill anything. And I think I'd prefer a res. How much is this? Okay, so if I use this... That's the furthest I can actually get you. I can still shoot a static cloud arrow. That would be well worthwhile, I think. You're welcome for being as damn squishy as I am. Let's get it. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Doesn't matter if Jahan gets stunned. Okay. Sorry. Just waste your action point. No, 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 no. Okay. Wait, he just revived the thing. Yes. He then he got stunned, so that's that's okay. Actually, it's funny because Jahan res resisted the stun. Don't move him. Now should I... Oops. Or should I revive? I'm gonna revive the group.
Slur. And then he got stunned. <laughs> You know what? No, no, no. Let's just let's just murder the shit out of everything like super fucking hard. I could have done more if I would have used a uh, poison cloud arrow, but A, I'm not sure if I have any of those, and B, I just murdered the shit out of the house. Well, that's okay, because I basically just did it for you <laughs> by killing the earth elemental. <laughs> So it's just what, that one guy and his little stupid friggin' ward that's like, not yeah. even moving? It's not mobile, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. kinda of hides in the back. There's an air resistance potion. Mm -hmm. No, it's a large one. Would that make more than one arrow? Probably not, right? Doesn't matter the size. It should totally make like three. My God, never short. This guy's tanky. He also has physical immunity, which I'm not particularly happy about. Though if I have line of sight next turn, I can give him a hard time. Let's see what we got here. What is he burning? What is four fighting units? Okay, it's just extra armor. Jahan too, whatever. Sorry, Jahan. I don't like you anyway. <laughs> yeah, he is kind of a dick, isn't he? Physical immunity, so... Might as well. Like, Jahan is such a stereotypical mage. Pompous, full of himself, thinks immortality is, you know, awesome, and, you know, he should pursue it at all costs. I do not like this guy. This infection diminishes me. <laughs> the disease went to him too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, that's... Huh. Honestly, I feel like we can just kind of pack at him at this point. He has physical immunity. Mm. And physical immunity means I have to use special arrows or else he doesn't, it, nothing happens. I have more of these than like any other arrow. And I, 
Aim, let me. Then. Fine. Use one of these then. Oh my god, game. <clears throat> That's weird, because I can hit him with Walgruff. Yeah, I can. And if I move much, I'm gonna end up in the, the not fun shit. <laughs> hey, Dickweed, can I hit you from here? 82% <laughs> chance. <laughs> from point blank range. I gave you the disease, and yes, you can, as long as you have elemental damage on your bow. Oh. Thanks. 
It looks like this is where those unfortunate lost ones await their fates. You there, human! Look, I promised not to bust your skull if you help an orc out of this cell. Oh, I'm like a whale in a cooking pot. Oh, I've been here since I was but a wee lad. Truth be told, these walls are just about all I know. But sunlight, blue thought I'm. And there's a whole bunch of jailers here. Okay. Drop the legendary ring. Ooh. Oh, right, I'm not. Cut my eyes on the ah, prize. I have to get used to that. Alright. Don't you find it interminably dull around here? Could be worse. My brother's a guard at King Briz's balance. Yeah. I'm sorry for your loss. And the ring is. Interesting. Please tell me Dex and Perception. No. Damn. It's plus one speed, plus 20% earth resist, and unlocks Vampiric Touch. No, oh, there's a better um, Vampiric Touch ring in the shop. It's like... Zeph, I'm wearing it. Oh, you finally... Uh, how many times did I... Uh, totally just, like, switched that. Anyway, uh... How many times did I have to tell you to buy that damn thing? I think I told you like four times. Like, dude, this thing has an intelligence on it, plus like other shit, plus some weird cut. Dull here. Right, I didn't mean to send you that ring. That's that's my bad. Can you send it back? Uh, yeah. It's the green one that I just sent you. It's you know selling it now. It has perception on it. What's this? There's two named elementals up here. 
I always want them to start my own business. Is that right? Artisanal hand soaps. You have lived until you tried my windswept eyes. You want a bomb? Ooh, Atten. Aerith. Ooh, she actually might be kind of bad. Oh, shit. You want a bomb? Uh, it's gonna heal the fire elemental, but sure. Might get rid of, uh, the ice elemental. Oh, I have a 70% chance to resist stun. <laughs> what is your... Oh yes, by all means, come to the door. Now they're gonna die! <laughs> Wanna watch the carnage? You know you can just watch it your screen. It's like it's infinitely more entertaining to creep up to your face. Um, in top floor of her house, there is a book that teaches you like an ability where you are able to equip, interact with, hold, touch the uh, the, the Tenebrium stuff, and really? it's reusable, meaning you can teach it to everybody. Just the one book. Oh, At least that's what Google told me. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck's up with rock. <laughs> Super stupid. Okay. Alright, I have a bunch of action points to play around here. Hmm. Hey Farron, how bad do you want um, these fire out or these elementals dead? Pretty badly. Pretty bad? Oh god, you're about to do that. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god, that is so amusing. <laughs>
Nice, and I have my extra perk. She dropped a lot of stuff. Oh, she dropped a legendary rope. She also dropped 12,000 experience. Oh, wow. <laughs> Drop something called Soul Sap? Lowers all the target's powers and resistances? It's a master witchcraft spell. Oh, she also dropped 11,317 gold. That's a lot of gold. Holy crap. What a fight. Dude, what the hell? She just dropped like fucking everything. Look, okay, I don't care if I'm walking slow through here. Oh, god. What now? No, you burst it. The there, there's a poison barrel over there. Oh, okay. So I popped. A, huh? Oh shit! I dropped the purple crossbow. Oh my god. this other one? Oh, he's way the hell over there.
Okay, I'm thinking this master uh, skill might be just a little bit better than the previous shitty fucking exploding corpse crap that I asked for. Hmm. How do we think? Yeah. Why is there a cloud now? <laughs> it's just a steam cloud. Pretty sure you can shoot through it. Yes, I can. Because I don't trust the 79. 100 GTF though. Yeah, dude. Check out this friggin' Arbalist, man. It might actually be an upgrade for me. Yeah, yeah I I'm doing what I can. Hey. Dude, I'm, <laughs> I'm excited, man. Oh, stop it. <laughs> no, excited. Also, this book. That's it right there. It's that. Striking it rich! Alright, Farron. Read the book. Oh, well, it's and then right. send it to the other guys and read it on them, too. Uh. Okay, so drop that. Drop that. So it's kind of hard. I've already to... mastered this material. Oh, it says that we've already mastered the material. Oh, so it just doesn't want everybody then. It would seem so. Nice. Alright, before I start. God damn it. I'll loot the room first. Always gotta loot the room. Now we can ID stuff. You're just gonna make me wait on that fucking piece of shit, aren't you? Yes, yes I am. You, sir, are a colossal dickwad. So hold on, how did... Go over there. It's like, be careful. I'll one-shot you. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff to identify. Um, okay. Let me go ahead and... I'm wondering, before I put this thing in here and learn a master spell... Wait, put what thing and where? Uh, basically a point, uh, because I, I leveled up to a level 15. Um, I'm wondering if I do, in fact, actually want to respec. Because a lot of these skill books, I know for a fact we can get them again. Honestly, do you even really need to respect? Like, what do you feel like you did wrong? Um, I feel like my skill points are too spaced out. I need to kind of go, what the hell? Huh. Look underneath your weapons skill tree. You'll see something new there. But yeah, it's like right now, you know, I'm expecting to Pyrokinetic, Hydrosophist, Geomancer, and Aerotherge. Um, and I feel like that's too many schools. I mean, I don't know. Wait, you said there's a new skill somewhere? Yeah, look underneath weapons. Uh, go, go to your character page. Oh, character page. Not the skill page. Cl click on, uh, the fist. Click on fist, click on weapons. Oh, yeah, Tenebrium. 
Very interesting. Okay, well, actually, before I do anything, let me go ahead and ID this stuff. Alright. Legendary Elven Shield. That's... Damn. Plus 2 Constitution. Plus 22% Earth Resist. Minus 0.75 Movement. Immune to Petrified. <laughs> oh, also, she dropped, like, two Master Skill Books. That is a fire stick. What? So she's dropping level 16 stuff. Cursed and crippled. That's just really nice. I'm working on it! Crossbow, 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 crossbow. Crossbow! I don't even see it in your inventory. It's because it's oh, there. Yep. That? Yes! Jesus, fine! Mr. Impatient? Do you want it, it yes or no? doesn't have any crit chance. <laughs> Just had to roll no crit, no, I don't want it. I'm mad. I'd hold on to that. And those watch, those are gonna fucking do crossbow and dex. Oh, I'm, just and dex. I'm just expecting all the metal bracers to roll with what I want, but they're metal, so I can't use them. That's a really nice uh, water mm. stick. Plus an one entire movement. movement. I haven't seen anything with an entire movement yet. Huh, that's interesting. Mass slow. <laughs> yeah, that. You were uh, talking about wanting to possibly give one of those to Jahan. Woo! There's two perception. Why can't that have been, like, something I could have used? Me. I already have a crafting. Oh, that's the reason why I was going. I forgot I still had all my crafting stuff equipped during that. Well, more specifically, I didn't have that equipped or that, which gives me four initiative. That's the reason why the turn order was all sorts of messed up. Yeah, I was wondering about that, actually. Well, there you go. Now you know. But anyway, the reason why, if you uh, looked, the reason why I'm tempted to respec is because I would like to be able to pick up multiple master spells, probably in like two different schools of magic. Right now, I have the option to pick up a master skill in either Pyrokinetic or Geomancer. The reason why, uh, for, for the respec, is because if I can get the points refunded to me from Hydrosophist um, and Aerotherge, or just even uh, from the level 2, so basically it would give me four skill points back, I'd still have one point in Hydrosophist and one point in Aerotherge, so I can still do some stuns, I can still do heals, things like that. Um, it would give me four additional skill points, which means I can pick up both a Masterwork Geomancer and Pyrokinetic Spell. Right now. Problem is, it's going to dump, like, all of your gold. I know. Because that's a lot of spells I'd have to relearn. Not bare minimum, let me go ahead and uh, level up Wolgriff. Wolgriff, another point into Expert Marksman for you. Stuck his skill point in the Hydrosophist.
That's for teleporting me. <laughs> I feel like I just got falcon punched. <laughs> That's because you did. By death punch. If you're curious, the damage it does on, with Jahan, now that it, you know, it, he actually has it, it does 671 to 821 crushing damage. <laughs> well, that'll be great for running into uh, elemental immunity stuff. Just teleport next to it and just falcon punch its genitals off. Because, <laughs> goddamn. Um... Alright, actually, you know, I think this would be a good idea. I think that if I'm going to respec, I need to run around all the shops and see what skill books... No, knockdown failed. Uh, what? And see what skill books, um, you know, I can get a, a hold of. Because if I can get a hold of all the skills that I already use, then it'll be fine. I'm actually old shit now. This ore is highly toxic. Thankfully, nothing but rubbish. Oh, that tenebrium ore. Tasty. And I'm not overweight. Yay! Also, you're not rotting to death. That's the important part. Yes, it is quite nice. Alright. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and cut the episode off here. I was not exactly expecting to run into... What's her name? Uh, Adden Barath. But that was that fight. Uh, whenever you see the next episode, probably going to be a little bit different. We're not going to be in the same spot and all that stuff because I'm about to run around and see if I can find all the skills that I use. That way I don't have to worry about losing things because if it's just a gold spewage then whatever. doesn't really matter. Um, so yeah, we'll see you in the next episode.